when the audience was applauding, it felt like they were also applauding the work that we did two months before. Eric Nira, the choreographer and founder of Exeb Dance Company, wanted to explore movement in different perspectives through digital. We worked together merging pure classical dance techniques and new technologies to extend the stage and elevate the performance to a new dimension. For me, for my work, the biggest challenge was that there's a combination of two facts. One is that we've never done this before, and the other one is that we have one, one shot at it. Artism Act 2 va proposer quatre perceptions différentes du monde. So Artism is the first such a kind of project for, for Unit 9. Uh, for the production, we had to change approach from what we usually do. It wasn't completely interactive, it wasn't completely live action, it was both put together. Uh, meaning that having to develop or write some code, but doing that in a live action environment was something completely new. There were many technical issues to address for the project, like rigging five projectors in uh, very specific places to avoid any distortion in the images and make sure that they merge perfectly. Rigging uh, connects uh, in exactly the right spots to make sure we cover the stage and we have a minimum distortion between them and we can then merge the image and track the stage better. We actually had to uh, fabricate uh, specific mounts for them to make, to make sure we can quickly rig them and get precise angles and positions. We built this completely bespoke tool from scratch uh, to uh, merge multiple Kinect feeds and of course the tool to play, to play back everything using uh, all these configurations. To complement the performance, we created a 3D model of David, the lead dancer. The 3D avatar was projecting on the back wall, which not only mirrored the movement of the dancer, but morphed from human into chimp when he kneels and back to human when he gets up. We use motion capture to make sure the movement is perfect. 64 sensors were attached on the dancer body with nearly 160 infrared cameras on the ground and on rigs surrounding the stage to get a perfect capture of every movement of his body. Simultaneously, the capture was applied to a 3D model, which we later just cleaned up and edited. One of the things that's um, interesting that we developed was um, a mapping tool, so that we could get all of the projections in the, in the right walls. And at the beginning, when we were rehearsing, we were doing it in an amateur way, going behind the, the stage walls and shouting to the person on the computer, say, a bit, a bit more to the top, a bit more to the left. And after a while, we just use technology that is available and we use the tablet to replicate the screen of the computer and we just tap on it and get the precision that we needed. So it sped up the process of mapping a lot. What we did was to create graphics that would be generated at real time based on the tracking that we would get on the stage. We designed the software to run the show just by pressing a button, but um, we designed it in a very flexible way so we can adjust the timing during the creative process. Also, we create a visualization for ourselves in 3D, so this can help to create visual effect and improve the creative process. I really enjoyed it um, and I hope we can do more of that. So yeah, it was a great experience.